Now, if we move on again and um, start talking about rocks that are containing or minerals. So if we have a rock that is mined to get a specific mineral that has a specific type of ore, we call that an ore deposit. Okay, so these are two examples of different ore deposits. On the left, we see a ore deposit that contains galena as the ore mineral, and galena is a ore mineral for lead. Well, it's very easy to see these crystals. These are those gray, kind of uh, cubic or angular looking shaped crystals. And then there's some other type of uh, minerals in there with it. So this is a rock that has galena. So this would be a pretty easy thing to identify as being um, a good ore deposit. Over to the right, we have a ore deposit containing gold. And um, this is a much more common example where just in hand specimen, you can't even see the ore mineral that uh, we're going after. So there's a very different type of harvesting process that goes with um, a very obvious um, ore deposit and then one that requires much more processing such as this gold ore deposit. deposit. And the process of removing these ore deposits, separating the minerals, is called mining. So now we're going to take a look at several um, different subtypes and types of mining.